Welcome to The Science of Everyday Things. Today, we're diving into the bubbly world of soap. Ever wondered how soap works its magic to clean our dishes, clothes, and hands? Let's uncover the science behind it. Soap might seem like a simple product, but it's packed with science. The key to soap's cleaning power lies in its unique structure and its ability to interact with both water and oils. Soap molecules have two distinct ends, one that's hydrophilic or water-loving, and one that's hydrophobic or water-repellent. The hydrophilic end is attracted to water, while the hydrophobic end repels it. Here's how it works. When you add soap to water with grease or oil, the soap molecules arrange themselves into structures called micelles. The hydrophobic tails attach to the grease, while the hydrophilic heads face outward, forming a sphere around the oil. As you scrub, the soap molecules trap the grease and oil inside these micelles. Rinsing with water washes the micelles away, leaving your hands clean. But what about those bubbles? They're more than just fun. The bubbles you see are formed because soap reduces the surface tension of water. This makes it easier for air to get trapped in the water, creating bubbles. Here, we're using a simple experiment to show how soap reduces surface tension. Watch as the soap spreads out and creates a layer that breaks. The surface tension of the water, making it easier for the soap to interact with oils and dirt. So next time you lather up, you'll know that science is at work, making sure you stay clean and fresh. Thanks for joining us on this bubbly adventure into the science of soap. Tune in next time for more fascinating insights into the science of everyday things. Until then, stay curious.